Hello everyone, welcome back to The 5 Reasons. I am Matthew Oliver, your wedding planner. I'm here to help you plan your perfect day with valid advice, tips and information. So I hope you enjoyed the weekend and you're enjoying this beautiful weather. Talking about the weather, this 5 Reasons is 5 Reasons No Strap Marks, please. No strap marks. We don't want strap marks at your wedding. Because not only does it make you look trashy and cheap, you also, it ruins your photos, it ruins your dress you feel really uncomfortable because you don't want them there but they're there you know how easy it is to get strap marks I obviously don't know personally because I'm not a female but I do know how easy it is to burn especially in this heat I am pointing outside when I'm doing this pointing thing thing so the five reasons on no strap marks please are number one obviously stay out of the sun if you're getting married in the next few days or weeks or even months you know, stay out of the sun. I know the weather is absolutely beautiful. You can go in the sun, maybe sit in the shade, or just, you know, take it easy and don't have a whole full day in the sun because that is where it goes bad. Okay, we don't want this. We don't want a burnt bride and we don't want a strap marble bride. Second reason, if you are going out in the sun, make sure you wear at least, 50, you know, 50 plus suntan lotion. Yes, you might not go beautifully brown, but at least you're protecting yourselves, you know? Because... That is the worst thing. Third reason, if you are going out in the sun again, or you're walking around or doing gardening, just wear strapless tops, bikinis, or just go completely naked. You know, actually I think going completely naked is the best way here because that's gonna help everything. You know, you're not gonna actually get strap marks. Everyone loves the natural, naturalist in us. And who, who, would, who would actually squint an eye if you just say, like, I'm getting married. If you say you're getting married and you're naked, people probably understand, be like, that's fine, yeah, just keep going. You don't worry about it, you look beautiful. So yeah, just go naked is probably the best way of getting rid of it, you know, or not, or even preventing it. Um, fourth reason, make sure you tell your bridesmaid exactly the same, because if I had a bridesmaid and she came to my wedding with strap marks, I'd fire her. I'd be like, sorry, you're not a bridesmaid anymore with that awful look. So make sure, it's so good for you to know what to do, but bridesmaids are a bit slow and don't exactly know what to do, unless they've been married before. If they've been married before, they understand the, the importance of no strap marks, but if they haven't, they're gonna go out in the sun and they're gonna get brown and they're gonna love it, you know, so soak up all the rays. So just make sure you tell your bridesmaids that we don't want strap marks, otherwise just fire them. And I'm sure they'll understand because I would, or they won't understand straight away, but if you explain the reasons why, then yes, they'll understand. <laughs> Fifth reason, if you do accidentally do get strap marks, if this video is late coming to you, then gradually put on fake tan. I hate saying fake tan because I hate fake tan. It's very bad stuff for your skin because it's like not really good for you. But you can get different tones of fake tan now. So you can get the same color of you and put it on. But don't put too much on at once. Just gradually put it on and you know, do it, you know. I'm not a female, I'm not a makeup artist either. So just, this is just my advice, just, you know, do it three days before you can't do it on the day of the wedding because otherwise it's not going to settle and your skin won't like it at all so just make sure if you are doing that make sure you put some you know fake tan on three days at least three days before or weeks before and or you can you know try and cover it up with makeup but that's going to take ages and it won't look as good um so these are the five reasons on no strap marks but if you do this then it's not going to happen i know you know it's obvious this video is obvious but it's not because people are still going out there with like um you know vests on and you're going to obviously get strap marks and it is such a hot at the moment you know it's so hot at the moment so why wouldn't you but people don't listen so anyway hope this video helps and i love you all stay tuned share the videos and if you have any ideas or want anything covered then just send me an email love you all and have a great day strap marks no strap marks suntan lotion tell your bridesmaids love you bye bye